For me, tennis is a way of life. It's not something you just turn on and off as soon as you step off a tennis court. It's the way you carry yourself, the way you live your life. It's looking forward to competition, to practicing, to improving. And all of these traits carry over into uh, who you become as a person. My dad got me into the sport of tennis. He wanted me to play a sport as a young kid and uh, put me into several different sports. And, um, you know, one day he put me in a group clinic and uh, I liked to play and hit the ball and enjoyed being with other kids. I uh, started my pro career in 2004 after I graduated from the University of Alabama. The most uh, important uh, moments in my tennis career, I'd have to say, um, as a competitor, is representing the Dominican Republic in Davis Cup because you're not only representing yourself, but you're representing your team and your country. So um, that was probably my highest uh, achievement or honor. Mm, besides that, also playing on teams in Europe for, for the different club teams in, the, in Germany, in the first Bundesliga I played. I also played um, in France and Austria, also in the first Bundesliga and in Italy. Um, is also quite an honor because, uh, you know, when you're contracted to play for a team, uh, they not only respect results, but they also, um, you know, expect the highest quality of uh, a person. I started uh, getting uh, certified as a coach while I was still competing as a player. And um, while I was getting certified uh, by the ITF, I have an ATP and WTA certification as well as the US PTA and PTR. Um, it showed me the importance of coach education. As I went along this journey and getting certified and learning as much as I could as a coach, I realized uh, the importance of coach education. And that's when I began uh, looking at different options as, uh, as a tutor. And so um, I've tutored courses at, uh, as an ITF uh, tutor. Uh, the play tennis course, the level one courses, and and also uh, I started to work uh, as the director of coach education for a registry called the Union of Professional Tennis. And so um, I gathered a group of uh, development officers to help me create short specific courses for coaches to help them in their development. I teach them how to run the programs properly so that the players are motivated to come out and continue to participate in this great sport. Well, I would say that the way that I coach uh, my players is I work on assimilating uh, match situations in the practice. So um, we work a lot on tactical situations and any sort of technical work we do uh, is within those tactical plays. So uh, we work a lot on that, a lot of the mental aspect of the sport. Physically, we work quite hard because the idea is for the practices to be hard and the matches to be easy in comparison. And so um, everything is uh, in preparation uh, for the matches and whatever we do have it be, the strength and conditioning, the actual drills, the point plays, they're all related so that way when you play the tournament matches, you'll be at your very best. I've been fortunate enough to work with uh, many players from uh, junior 10 and under players all the way to the, the highest elite athletes um, and for me it's quite an honor. I've gone to the Grand Slams with them uh, including uh, Beres Vanareva, um, Ala Kudrytseva, I've been with uh, Nicolas Almagro, I've been with John Isner, and several other players um, at tournaments, sparring with them, uh, doing trainings with them, um, you know, Ruben Ramirez Hidalgo, did a training block at Alicante. So all these uh, experiences are great for me because I feel like um, not only do I help the players develop and, you know, give them the information that I've gathered throughout the years, but I also learn from them. And so, um, you know, tennis is, a, is an amazing sport. I feel like it helps people throughout the world. Sport, and specifically tennis, helps people in so many ways. Um, I've been fortunate enough to be able to play a part in that. Um, through tennis, people learn life skills such as 
discipline, team building, socialization, um, time management, you know, all kinds of learning experiences that you can apply in your daily personal lives. And so, um, you know, I've been fortunate enough through different avenues to be able to help uh, people through the sport of tennis, which is my passion. So um, I have a foundation called One Love Tennis, which uh, um, creates play days for children that are at risk, um, living in orphanages throughout the world. And, uh, you know, I, I gather prizes, gifts, nets, rackets, balls um, for the kids. So that way they can have a nice day, a positive memory to hopefully replace some of all uh, the negative and trying times and memories that they had in their youth, uh, which I feel is uh, invaluable. And throughout the years, uh, I've not only pursu pursued and achieved many of my goals, but also just the um, just the pathway and uh, and the journey that this sport has um, given me. Um, has been more satisfying than the actual end result.